Can you use winter tyres all year round? Well this is what I'm hoping to find out today in this simple braking test. Basically I have my car in summer tyres, so I've got new Yokohama summer tyres here. It's 19 degrees today in July, mid-summer. So I'm going to travel along to the far side of the road at the end, travel back towards the cones at 30 mile an hour, 40 mile an hour, 50 and 60, slam on the brakes and then measure how far it takes for us to get to a complete stop. First of all, I'm going to do the test in my summer tyres and then I'm going to change the tyres to winter and then do the same braking test. Next, we'll try the winter tyres. So as you can see, these Yokohama winter tyres have thick grooves in there to dissipate all the snow and the slush. In conclusion to this real world braking test, we can see that out of the four different speeds, for three of the braking tests it took longer to stop in the winter tyres. At mid-range speeds there wasn't too much difference between the winter tyres and the summer tyres. However, at lower speeds and higher speeds, the distance required to brake was up to 13% more in the winter tyres. When deciding whether to run winter tyres all year round, there are a few things to consider to help you decide. One of them is that although in peak summer, the average temperatures in this country are between 11 and 19 degrees, over the whole year the average temperature is only 6 to 13 degrees, and winter tyres work best below 7 degrees. Something else to consider is that in 2020 we had 147 days of rain out of 365 days in the year. Now if you live in the north of England where temperatures are on average are low, or you live in a wet climate like the Lake District, you may choose to use winter tyres all year round. I hope you found this video useful or at least interesting. I would love to hear your own experience using winter tyres all year round or whether you prefer all season tyres.